Ladies and gentlemen, uh, uh, welcome to my show, Openly Atheist Show. I'm really sorry, just uh, the second time I think I'm speaking English. Um, I used to do my uh, program in Arabic, that's why just like jumping in is a little bit difficult. Anyway, um, today, I supposed to have an opposite about uh, a message to uh, British people. Uh, to be honest, <laughs> I schedule my uh, opposite on YouTube three times. Two times has been deleted. Uh, I wasn't sure how it was being deleted. And the uh, third time before the live show start about half an hour. I found out that all my channel been stolen anyway. So thank you very much. Thank you very much who did this. I mean, uh, the uh, religion of peace, of course, supporter who done this. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm not sure we uh, really, I'm not sure how you how you did it or people who stole my channel did it but anyway i'll talk about this later on maybe in the uh in the opposite later on in time anyway um my my message was to be honest uh, my message is to british people who who believe who believe that Islam is peaceful religion. Um, there is so many things, to be honest. I'm, I'm really I'm uh, nervous now because my channel being closed, uh, stolen actually, uh, about two hours from now, two hours ago, and uh, a little bit I'm nervous. That's why I'm just struggling to speak. I just want to find my notes what i have been wrote here speak about um let's start what is islam now we saw unfortunately we saw the uh on wednesday the uh, terrorist attack on the uh British Parliament, and to be honest, it's not enough to say sorry, or sorry for you lost, it's not enough at all, it's not enough, uh, I think word is, is, is not enough, because life is life, and every single life is important, is, is unique, we can't say sorry and that's it, but why is this happening over and over and over again? Why is this happening just all the time? Simply because of Islam. It's not a Muslim. Muslim, they are victim of Islam. You know, in, in, in Quran uh, itself, all chapters in it is, you, you, you can just like, uh, separate three three parts one kill and kill about fighting the other one about sex and the other the third one about superstitions that's what quran based on uh there is so many people now say uh, who, who doesn't know Islam, people who doesn't know Islam will say uh, Islam is peace for religion. Peace for religion, but people understand mistakenly, like they misunderstood Islam, they practice in uh, different Islam, whatever. But let me tell you that people who who, who fighting all the time, like what we saw on uh, 
But it's parliament. They understand Islam. They practice in Islam very well. They practice in Islam very well, literally. They practice in Islam uh, number by number, we can say, verse by verse. Now, uh, usually my, my show, I was going on my speech in different uh, direction, to be honest, but uh, unfortunately what's happened, happened. They want to shut every mouth, shut everybody, not to talk about their religion, peace for religion. So they closed my channel. I was, uh, I prepared for something different, to be honest, but now I have to speak something different, you know, because they closed my channel. Anyway, let me introduce myself to British people. I was going to send a message to explain what Islam is, what Islam is about, why they, the Muslims doing that. They fight in everywhere. That was my message. But when they closed my channel, honestly, I'm, I'm very nervous and uh, so many, so many uh, ideas is gone. Uh, anyway, first of all, first of all, um, uh, my name is Jamboro. I uh, produce a um, uh, program on YouTube which is called Openly Atheist in Arabic. I got the uh, opposite uh, today, actually. I finished the uh, opposite number 383. Uh, but, you know, after like half an hour when I finished the opposite, they closed my channel. And they stole my channel, actually. They stole it. And now they're deleting the uh, whatever uh, videos in it. So, in this program, I try to explain what Islam is. Uh, we're not attacking Islam. We're not trying to insult Islam or, you know, to do... We are only criticizing Islam from its own sources, like Quran and Hadith. I mean... Will everybody will say it's peace for religion, peace for religion? Okay, is uh, if it is peace for religion, why we don't see this in practice? That means there is something wrong. What is the wrong? There is nothing wrong. Islam is not peace for religion because in practice. People who believe in, in Islam, they practice the source, practicing Quran, and Quran never been uh, peaceful. I mean, there is so many verses which say you have to fight who is not Muslim, even if they don't fight you. You have to fight them, to put them un uh, under the Islamic ro rule. Honestly, I just worry why is this happening to us? Like, in we as an atheist, we try to uh, educate people about Islam. We're not just bringing uh, verses from Mars or from Jupiter, no. We bring in the verses from Quran itself. We bring in whatever is in the Quran. So I can't believe that I'm in Britain today, 2017. Today is 25th of uh, March, 
2017, and I cannot speak out what I want to speak. I mean, I, I started to make videos in 2015. And I've got a channel, got to about 10,000 sus subscribers. They closed it because they didn't like what I'm saying. The way they closed, closed it, they make groups and make reports to YouTube and YouTube automatically close the channel down. When you appeal against the decision, they don't care, they see numbers, how many people uh, report your channel, that's it. You said, okay, you start all over again. I start another uh, channel got about uh, 6,000 su subscribers and being closed again because of false reports. As I said, the supporters of Al-Qaeda and ISIS, they gather themselves and report the channel on YouTube automatically without any thing even not look at because it's, it's Arabic speaking so they don't care you close the channel and today because I think uh, my channel didn't uh, get enough reports to be closed they just stolen it uh, somehow I'm not sure how they delete now all the videos in it. Why they doing this? Why they do is trying to shut up every mouth? Why they trying to kill everyone speak against them? Simply because they don't have something to give. They don't have nothing. I mean, they have only superstitions. They believe in, in superstitions only. They, they can't give you proof about their faith. I, I wish, I wish in this year, 2017, to be free speech, a year of free speech, let's say. So we can express ourselves as I, we want to. Not every now and then close this channel and close this account. What for? because you're against Islam, you're criticizing criticize Islam. We're not saying something from our pocket, we didn't bring anything from our pocket. Everything we say, we criticizing is in your religion, Islam. If it's True religion, as you say, why are you afraid of criticizing it? Why are you just afraid? Why you can't speak to me and stand to shut me up and close my channel, stole my channel, steal my channel, sorry, or kill me as it's happened in British Parliament, it happened in France, it happened in Belgium, it happened in everywhere.
if you got you believe in your religion why it's happened all over again and again and again What is Islam? Many people will think is Islam is uh, a religion, and they they call it the religion of peace. I wonder, really, I wonder. If wasn't religion of peace, what's gonna happen? You know, religion of peace, and we see all this, this destruction. They destroy everything, everything in life. They hate life. If it wasn't peace of a uh, religion of peace, what's gonna be? I mean, uh, Islam is not a religion. Let me tell you this thing: Islam is not a religion. Islam is political ideology. Is political ideology only. Islam is power. There is no Islam which is a uh, Holy Spirit, whatever. Islam is power. Islam is money. Islam is global. It's gonna be global. I mean, no Muslim, no Muslim believing in Islam, true Islam, will accept you if you are not Muslim as brother, will never call you brother because you are not human for him. You are second class human at least. You are unhuman for him. You know, when you see ISIS uh, beheading some uh, people or killing people somehow, burn, burn them or whatever, you know, the way they kill them. They don't feel them as a human. Because they believe in true Islam. They don't feel them as a human. I'm, I'm just wanna say really I'm sorry because of my English it wasn't clear enough because I've been like more than five years I haven't I haven't spoken English I didn't speak English for a long long time that's why my English is not good enough to explain every single word you know I forgot so many words but it doesn't matter whatever you know I'm, I'll try to explain whatever I can and the way I can. You know, uh, the, the true Muslim, now there's so many, for me as an atheist, you know, I don't believe in any, any God, any religion, but, but there is some religions who shortest way to God, to their God, is to pray for him, for example, to be honest with your God. But in Islam, shortest way to God is to kill other people. Absolutely, this is the shortest way to God, to be martyr. To kill someone, to be killed, that's it. You don't have steps between you and the paradise. Bet between you and the uh, 72 versions. There is no steps. If you die as a martyr, you go to paradise straight away. There is no ju judgment day for you. 
God will not come and say, you did this, you done that. No. He will open the door straight away. Door of the paradise, of course. This is the shortest way between you and God, when you kill people and be killed. That's why people now just commit suicide and threaten other people and shutting our mouths. I mean, our mouths, mouths. They try everything and they have nothing to give, no proof. Who gonna give you proof of flying donkey, for example? In Quran there is flying donkey. Who gonna believe in flying donkey? What's the kind of proof gonna give you? Flying donkey. Of course there is no flying donkey. I never been flying donkey. Don't believe anything a true Muslim will tell you. Don't believe anything true Muslim tells you. I mean, I'm talking to people who doesn't know Islam. Because Muslim will speak to you and you are not a Muslim, there is something called taqiyya in Quran which will lie to you and makes you feel that he's your friend and inside he's your enemy. He will lie to you everything he will lie to you on everything because is written in the sources of Islam being written in Quran being written in Hadith Taqiyya. there is so many ways to lie he will tell you, Quran tells you, you have to lie in sake of Islam, for benefit of Islam. If you have to lie, you have to lie. No matter who, even, even for example, if I was like, say I am, I am a Muslim, I, I have to lie to my father, my mother, my brother, it doesn't matter. Not just a stranger. I have to lie. I have to kill even my father, my mother, my brother. And what's, what's re happening in reality? If we look in Syria who killed his mother, beheaded his mother in front of the cameras. We saw them in the sake of Islam. Islam is brainwashing. Is culture from the desert. Which doesn't care anything. Is barbaric, is savage, is unsuitable for our age. I wish if I had the time to prepare for this speech, to be honest, but, you know, I, I did, I did, but they, they don't want me to speak. I borrow 
uh, my friend Chana, thank you very much, uh, Abul Hakam ibn Kathir, thank you very much, because you, uh, you uh, lend me your channel to speak through. We, we, we have to find a solution. We have to find a solution. Solution is not to have more power or more police or more armies, whatever, you know, weapons. I don't think so. You can kill thousand, two, three, hundred thousand of them, but the ideology is there. I always say like, you know, the, 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 the Muslim scholar, Muslims, uh, clerics, they got hundreds, literally hundreds of uh, TV stations. An atheist like me, in the Arab world, they don't have, even, even, even the social media is not ours, to be honest. Because we opened the account now, they close it for us tomorrow. And it's the same happening all the time. We wish of, if only the social media for us. The only way we can defeat Islam is by education. How we can educate people? I wish if, if there is somehow could the British government stand to bring so many polices or so many soldiers, whatever, to make few TV stations for atheists, for example. And so already, like, I'm, my program, to be honest, I introduced so many atheists who left Islam after they understand Islam. If you want to defeat Islam, we have to make people understand Islam. Whoever now, the Muslims, they don't understand their religion very well. They don't understand the, their religions, honestly. And who understand it? 90% from who understand Islam, or I'll say 95% of them will leave Islam after they understand Islam. And 5% they will become ISIS, Al-Qaeda. So, because, simply, because Islam, in the source of it, is all about fighting and sex, superstitions. But mostly, they want to spread Islam. How? By fighting people forcing people to convert to Islam. This is the way they know. They will try to shut any mouth, speak, or criticizing their religion. 
they cannot accept any voice against them. This is Islam. The solution is to make people understand Islam, to educate people. And at least to have like for, uh, for us, the atheist, the speaking Arab atheist, I mean, make some TV station for them, to make their voice heard. Anyway, I uh, thank you very much. I'm really, I'm not sure if I could uh, pass my message or not. But really, I'm nervous. I haven't like, you know, uh, prepared something, you know, just like all the ideas is gone, steamed. Because what's happened today, they, uh, they stole in my channel, literally, they stole in my channel. And I borrow my friend channel. So, maybe in the future I'll make uh, an English program, like weekly opposite, maybe, something like this. But I'll carry on with the Arabic, I'm not going to stop. I'm not gonna stop. It's my fight. It's my fight. Whoever done this, I don't care about you. I care about my people who, who just they live in in darkness age. I'll try to light up their way to open their mind about the reality in this life and make them deny these superstitions, these bloody superstitions. Anyway, I thank you very much and I hope really, I hope this message will get the YouTube uh, people who just close any any uh, uh, YouTube channel just because of reports. And I hope if someone of them hear me to reopen my channels, you know, there is three channels and apply for it, appeal for it, I visit Google uh, office as well. I hope you do something in sake of the true sake of humanity. And we can defeat the terrorist. Honestly, we can defeat the terrorist when we love each other. When we love each other. Uh, anyway, thank you very much, and uh, let you go now, and uh, I, I hope I could do anything more in English. Uh, but honestly, I'm, I'm not sure if I've done whatever I want to do now in this opposite, on this message. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you one thing, don't let it go. We will defeat Islam. We will defeat Islam. And I believe in science. I believe in humanity and freedom. Freedom will defeat Islam. We will defeat Islam. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.